We start tonight with Kansas lawmakers marking today as Joey Weber Remembrance Day. Thanks for joining us. I'm Brooke Lennington. A Kansas police officer killed Weber in 2016. Weber was autistic. And our Capitol Bureau reporter Rebecca Chung joins us live at the State House to tell us how lawmakers are honoring his memory. Weber's tragic death pushed lawmakers to take action in 2017, passing a law to help others with cognitive disorders. Today marks four years since the law was signed. Now lawmakers are taking a look back at his life and the legacy he's left behind. It's a very great feeling. Joey Weber's parents back in 2017 celebrating the signing of Joey's Law, allowing people with cognitive disorders to use signs to alert police officers. This comes after police shot and killed Weber, a 36-year-old with autism, during a traffic stop in Hayes, igniting a call for justice. Now lawmakers are celebrating the life Joey lived, marking April 7th, 2021, as a day of remembrance. Joey was a fun-loving uh, young man that he enjoyed being with friends living with these parents. Because of Joey, people with cognitive disorders can use alerts like stickers on license plates, placards, or signs on their driver's license to notify officers of their disability. Lawmakers say this will help prevent people like Weber from facing similar situations in the future. Joey's parents continue to honor his life, providing scholarships to people with disabilities. Live at the Capitol, I'm Rebecca Chung.